I just picked up a few things, um, a little more than a few things. <laughs> It's your girl Renee and I am back with another video. As you can tell from the title, it is a fashion one. So this is a haul and what's crazy is that it is February, almost like the second week of February and literally it's still freezing. So I live in Austin, Texas where the weather is not as crazy as I guess Chicago and New York and all of those like especially the Midwest is getting all of those crazy snowstorms and blizzards and stuff. So um, I do have a little bit of an advantage. However, I still have some colder weather here. Um, a lot of people expect when they come here that they can just up and wear, you know, flip flops and shorts when that is not the case. It literally is getting cold like today. I mean, yeah, it's 40 degrees today, but honestly, like 40 degrees with wind can be pretty brutal a little bit. So with that being said, a lot of stores actually were starting to put a lot of their new spring collections out and they're putting a lot of their more winter items on sale, which obviously is going to benefit us all because guess what we're still in the winter months so right now if you are looking to spruce up your winter wardrobe or if there's things that you actually did not pick up this winter like season you should probably go shopping right now because it is all on sale which is like great for us consumers right so i just picked up a few things um a little more than a few things <laughs> that i want to share with you guys and it's mostly like accessories and things that you can kind of add to your outfit to make them a little more fun one of my most favorite things to collect basically is between shoes and handbags i am starting to collect a few designer pieces but um overall like i look for like great quality i look for textures i look for patterns and things that can really make my outfit stand out so these pieces i'm going to show you definitely like fit that guideline so if you're looking for a little more minimalistic vibes you're not going to get that here i'm definitely all about the patterns the textures and just that the way that you can just bring a basic outfit to the next level so first off one of my most favorite stores to shop at is urban outfitters i picked up these booties right here so one of my most recent hauls i believe i shared with you guys some mohair booties and they're so similar except they were more of a sneaker this is a true boot it's like an ankle boot it's definitely that really amazing navy blue mohair and i feel like on camera it's coming off a little more bright and vibrant whereas in person is very very dark a very very like midnight type of color so these are just bomb these are actually only twenty dollars from urban outfitters which is insane um i think the shoe was originally 90 bucks so one of the next things i got from urban outfitters is actually a bag and it's this handbag right here i love this handbag because of the really cute colorway it's this really nice green color and then these sides are like an egg shell type of color kind of like an off-white um it does come with a shoulder strap but then it also has like these handles so you can just hold it off to the side i felt like a bag like this is so awesome it is like a faux leather i'm not sure if you're getting that but this is just like the cutest bag to add to your wardrobe i love having like a really cute coat on and then having like a really dope bag to kind of give it that extra oomph you know but um this is just super cute i think this was only 20 bucks and this is from the urban outfitters brand so really really cute really chic in 2017, one of my most favorite trends that I actually jumped on board with was the mules. I had never been a mules person. I usually opt for shoes that have some type of ankle strap or just some type of like entire like whole shoe but mules are so effortless and they were so chic and really really feminine to me so i decided to like really incorporate them into my wardrobe and i've been finding them left and right so one of the first pairs i got from urban outfitters is this one and i love the pattern on this one this really nice plaid color i love the greens and the blues mixed together it's just a really really cute shoe and i love these because you can totally pair them with denim you can totally wear it with a dress you can do really anything with the mule so that's why i really like to incorporate these into my style now and yeah these are super super chic these are only ten dollars so can't go wrong with a good ten dollar pair of shoes 
This next pair is basically the exact same thing except it's a different colorway. It is in this really nice rich red color. It does have a hint of yellow and then this really nice like blue kind of a cobalt type of royal blue color. Um, like I said, they're the exact same shoe but they're just a different colorway. Really chic, really effortless and easy to pair. Um, but this pair was actually $4.99. So $5 for a really, really cute mule. Like that's insane. So love these the next and final thing i'm going to show you from urban outfitters are actually what i was just wearing right now and it is some slippers so these are like your nice faux fur slipper i know the faux fur trend was like super popular last year and i love these slippers they're so comfortable they're really sturdy and structured too so you don't have to worry about them like getting all like out of shape and stuff so and they're just super chic I love to walk around my house with these like little fur slippers on I feel like because of the soles and how like structured and hard it is you probably could get away with wearing them outside too and I know that they make a lot of shoes like this wearable for outside however like I want to wear them in the house I think I'm not probably gonna wear them outside but they're really really chic and really really cute so and these were on sale for ten dollars so so sticking with the mules, one of my other favorite stores to shop at is Nordstrom Rack. Nordstrom Rack has such great deals regardless of if it's like a sale or not, but I did end up picking up these shoes while there was the Nordstrom Clear the Rack sale and I absolutely love that sale. You can totally find all kind of unique things for great, great affordable prices. I found these amazing mules and I love the like fringy type of detail that these have on them these are really chic i feel like they're i feel like that's the word that i'm using nowadays like i'm just like i want to be chic i want for my wardrobe to look more polished and stuff like that so i've been looking for a lot of things that can like make my outfits effortlessly chic <laughs> so um these are awesome these are actually from the brand steve madden and these were only 19 dollars. so really really great deal actually i think they were 19 dollars, and then they were an additional percentage off like i think their clear the rack sale was 25 percent off or something crazy like that so they were actually cheaper than that so <laughs> such a good steal um they're like a really nice like suede material i'm not sure if it's picking up the actual details because this shoe literally is super cute but yeah it's a really really good like brown color I, I hope that you can see that but yeah another one of my favorite stores to shop at is Target and I feel like you can never go wrong in Target every time I go in there I always find something and they always have like great selections in their clearance section so with it being like the sale going on with all the winter stuff trying to get pushed out and all the new spring is going in of course one of the main things that were on sale were their fur stoles or like neck collar scarves and I love a good neck scarf so I have been looking on the hunt for a really nice black one and this one was so nice i love that it's actually pretty long as well i sometimes don't like that fur stoles tend to end up being like really really short um i like for it to kind of dangle longer and i feel like it makes you a little more warm that way so like i said it's still winter time so this is totally appropriate and this will of course flux into the next season of course because obviously fur is always going to be on trend every single winter season this was actually originally twenty dollars and i got it for 14 13.98 so really really good deal i feel like the next purchase from target is this really really cute bag and it is kind of shiny it's not a true patent leather or anything like that so the material definitely just has a really nice shine to it um this is obviously not real leather or anything like that but what i love most about it is that it's a really cute chic uh shape to it it really has these uh unique gold hardware onto the bag and this bag basically mimics the chloe bag you can never go wrong with a good you know chloe dupe so this bag was only six dollars at target and obviously the chloe bags are like thousands of dollars so this was a really really great steal and um if you're trying to achieve that chloe look without it being super expensive 
this is a great alternative a lot of companies actually are starting to create like Chloe dupes because I think that's like the it hot bag right now and a lot of companies are starting to put these really cute um, circular like finishings on the bag so I think that's really cute so Lately, I've been doing a lot of shopping at Francesca's, and if you're not familiar with Francesca's, it is a boutique. They have tons of locations all around the United States, but Francesca's is kind of like a hidden gem. I feel like some people don't really know about them, but they do have some really nice, like, staple pieces for your wardrobe, and then they ha tend to have, like, a few trendier pieces as well. So I did catch some really good sales, and I found this booty, first of all, super chic. I love the velvet detailing it is a really nice cranberry red color it's not a true red but it's more of like a cranberry-esque type of color and I love like the little detailing on the back too with the bow really really great heel as well because I'm not a person who like walks in heels for forever so I look for a really good sturdy chunky heel and it doesn't have like too much of a like instep where you know your arch is going to be killed by the end of the night so I look for booties like this and I just thought these were super chic and cute that's my like forever phrase super chic it's so chic so the next pair of booties I got from Francesca's are these they are also velvet this is really cute royal blue color um, it also has lace up detailing in the back with a bow which is really cute um, I just think these are just like like I said, basically effortless. You build an outfit based off of like true basics. So you can have like a t-shirt on, some jeans, some ripped jeans, and then throw on a booty like this and it just takes your outfit to the next level. I did pair these and I have a picture on my Instagram if you want to go out and check it out. I am rgmode underscore. So on Instagram, so you can totally check me out over there if you want to get any outfit inspos from me. But yeah, I picked these up and I just love the detailing in these. So the last boot I got from Francesca's is these really tall, over the knee, pretty much thigh high boots, especially on me because I am 5'4", so I'm pretty short. So they come up pretty tall on me. Um, the heel is what I love the most because it's pretty thick. Like I said, I love a good chunky heel. It's easier to walk in. They're very comfortable. Um, and these are just really bomb. They're kind of like a faux suede material. So um, they give you a little more of an elevated look as well. So you can totally dress up any super casual outfit and just throw these on. So next I picked up this bag and like I said, the trend right now is the Chloe bag and a lot of companies are mimicking that structure and shape and the hardware as well is very, very like the Chloe bags. So I absolutely love the braiding detailing around this little cute crossbody um, and I love the hardware, the circular hardware that's on here. This bag does come with a strap so you can totally wear it um, as a crossbody or if you wanted to just, you know, hold it by these cute little um, circular hardware pieces, you totally can. But I just love it. I think it's so, like, I think it's so chic. If I say that one more time, oh my god. But I mean, honestly, I do. I just think that it's so um, unique and I love the style of it. And, you know, that Chloe bag, like, I wish that I can get a Chloe, I can get my hands on a Chloe bag. But... <laughs> This will have to do. The last item I got from Francesca's is this bag right here. It is in this really nice navy blue color. It does have a mohair pocket on the front. I do have tons of shoes actually that have mohair on them. So I kind of thought that this would be really chic to add. Oh my God. I thought this would be really cool, cute, awesome, unique great i thought this would be a great piece to add to my wardrobe seeing as how i do already have a few mohair pieces so this is really really cute i actually do also like the fact that it has shoulder straps you can totally wear it as a crossbody bag or you can hold it like this i really like to hold my bags like this nowadays i don't know what it is but i just feel like it makes my outfits look better i don't know but um yeah so cute 
So locally, one of my favorite stores here in Austin is a store called Lux Apothetique. And it is a really, really unique store. They have a lot of edgy pieces. They have a lot of um, just really fashion forward, trendier items. So when I go in there, I know that I'm going to find something so cute and cool. Um, the first thing is actually a bag that I actually featured on my Instagram yesterday, my post from yesterday. And it is this bag it's so cool as you can tell i'm really a trend what I'm, I'm really a trend um as you can tell i'm really into polka dots and i love this bag i feel like this bag basically adds a statement to any outfit like ever you can wear black and white you can actually have on something totally polar opposite of black and white and pop this bag and it will just make your outfit that much better i love the detailing of this one so what I'm finding is that a lot of bags basically mimic higher end bags and this bag so much reminds me of the Louis Vuitton bag. There's tons of them that have this like really cool detailing of like a lock and key type of thing. So I thought that was pretty chic. Um, it actually fits tons in here. I didn't think that it was going to fit that much. It opens up this wide but then it has so much room in here. It even has like a little separate back compartment. So I was pretty impressed yesterday of the amount of stuff I stuffed in here. But um, yeah, it's so cute. I'm just so impressed. And I got some compliments on my bag and I was like, thanks. <laughs> it was literally $5. Kid you not. The next bag I picked up from Lux was this guy right here. I think this bag is so unique. I love the detailing of it. If you look at it, it kind of looks like it has multiple colors as in like black and kind of like gray as well. But when you really look at it, it's still only black. It just has that really cool like texture to it. And I feel like that is what I'm talking about when it comes to really elevating your outfits and style and getting some really fun like textures into it. It can definitely take your outfit to the next level like that's just all I keep talking about and it's like you know build your outfit around some basics and then get some really fun accessories and your outfit will go to the next level so what is so unique about this bag is that this um, little closure here kind of reminds me of a like a paper clip type of situation so the flap is basically just stuffed inside of this really cool like paper clip thing um, and then it just has like tons of room in the inside so it's a really really good bag to have um, and I just think that it's so cool and it does have a back compartment too so it's just a really great crossbody bag so the next thing I got was this cute little coin pouch and it's like a little wristlet. Um, I actually tried putting my little wallet in here. I have like a little card holder from Coach. It did not fit in here. Um, I tried putting something else in here and it just would not fit. And I was like, what am I going to wear? What am I going to do with this thing? So I haven't quite found it out yet. And I don't know exactly how I'm going to use this because I obviously can't put my phone in here, but I just thought this was super cute. Um, I love this like emeraldy green color. If you guys watched my last really big fashion haul, if you haven't, I'll have it linked down below, but I did purchase some velvet emerald green, um, booties, which I thought would look really cute with this. So I'm thinking about like creating some type of really cute outfit and like surrounding around this cute little pouch. But what am I, what am I going to put in here? A lip gloss? Like I need money. Like I'm going to have to like get cash out, fold it up and put it in here. Like, I don't know, but this is so cute. This is also only $5. That previous bag I just showed you was only $5. Like legit. If you live in Austin, go to Lux because they legit have so many great deals. When the seasons change, they literally put their things on super, super sale. And I think they have a super sale going on right now too, where it's like buy to get one free or something crazy. So if you live in Austin, go to Lux. Um, the last two items I got from Lux are <laughs> literally the highlights of my entire shopping experience there. So I ended up finding what I'm hoping to be the best purchase ever. So, I ended up picking up oh, this right here and yes, yeah, so you're looking at it and you're like, oh cool, a fur purse crossbody bag. How cute. So yes, that is kind of what it is. It does have a compartment right here where you put all of your belongings in, all of your things that you're going to carry around with you. But the highlight of this bag is that it actually is a muff. You saw my hand disappear. Yes, this is a muff. 
I remember when I used to play with my Barbies back in the day when I was a kid and my Barbie had a muff and I used to just be like stuffing her little arms inside of the muff and she had like a little fur coat. She was super like princess Barbie. I don't know like she was she was you know a queen like she had it all like she had every amazing outfit there was. And when I saw this, it just took me back. Like it was so nostalgic. I was like, oh my God, I have a muff. Like this is, this is insane. Like, so this was literally $5 as well. I actually got it in red as well because <laughs> I could not pass it up. They had a couple other colors that I was like, Renee, you're doing too much. Like calm down, scale back. But I just thought this was so chic. So can't wait to style this. I feel like this would be super cute. I even think I'm going to keep the chain on here even as I like wear it as a muff and have it like off to the side. I have my hands down and then a chain hangs and I feel like it's like editorial fashion shoot something. I don't know. Like this is just so cute to me. Let me know down below. Do you think this is like dope or not? Like am I am I like envisioning wrong? Like I don't know. I just feel like this is so cute. I mean and if you didn't want to have your hands inside of the muff you obviously can just wear it as a regular like fur crossbody bag. But I just thought that was so dope. So that's one of the reasons why I did pick up that black fur stole from Target because I want to create like a really cute like fur type of outfit. Um, I mean, it's still freezing, so might as well. Um, but yeah, so I picked this up and I just cannot believe how adorable these are. Like, they're so cute. I cannot wait to style it. All right, guys, so that was all the things that I basically picked up for this like winter sale. If you guys are looking for anything right now, go into the stores right now. Legit, everything is on sale, I promise you. If you're looking for a really good deal and you know that your wardrobe is neglecting a few things, go check out a few stores because I'm sure they are having like an amazing, crazy sale right now. Um, but yeah, if you're liking any of the things that I have talked about in this video, definitely let me know down below. Let's have a discussion. Like I said in my previous video, don't be afraid. Let's have the discussions. Let's talk about fashion, all of that. And if you would like for me to style any of these pieces that I showed you guys in this video, definitely let me know that as well because I would love to do a lookbook or some type of like how to style video of some sort. Thank you guys for watching my video and uh, see you in my next one. Bye. another haul video you know you can shop and get deals right did you know did you know <laughs>